My name's Matt, welcome back to the shop. And today, we this is the competition. We're gonna have a competition. We're gonna run a competition. That's what we're gonna do. <laughs> competition, just keep on saying the word competition, it'll be fine. My name's Matt, welcome back to the shop. And the other day I did a video on um, the DID chain and the DID tool, but more about the tool itself. I was carrying around that fucking brake disc and it shattered my box, so I'm going to have to get some glue out and sort that out. Because um, that's one of the cool things about these, is you can, you know, keep these all pretty and all the rest of it if it's in its fucking box. But anyway, I'll keep that there because that's the number of the tool. So, um, number one is people are saying, don't you have to grind off the rivets? Uh, no, you don't. That's the whole point. If you look at the actual um, instructions from Did, they say no, it doesn't really matter. Some people are saying you really want to split the mask link. Yeah, yeah, you can do that. I was just showing you how the process works, not exactly what link you want to go for. If you actually look at that piece of chain that I have from the XJ, I did remove one of the um, master rivets. Basically, they're a bit weaker than the other ones. Someone asked, did pushing it through... Um, forcibly pushing it through, does that fuck up the rivets? No, not really, because it's under compression. The rivet itself is a different type of steel than the actual link plates themselves. Um, what else do people ask? Oh yeah, people are saying, oh, I do it the old school way with basically a hammer and a chisel. Oh, please say we're not still doing that. Uh, <laughs> grinding the heads off, yes, it makes it a tiny bit easier. You don't have to do it, there's really no need to do it. It does make it a tiny bit easier, but it's up to you if you want to do that or not. If you're going to grind the rivets off, you might as well just grind the entire chain off. Just cut the links and break the chain in away you go. Um, what else was there? Someone said... Oh yeah, the hammer and the... Oh, the hammer... Like getting a punch, not a chisel. A punch and a hammer. Oh. The other problem with that is, is how do you then rivet, you know, rivet it... Um, you know, what you're doing, putting a centre punch in it and whacking it, that's... Uh, yeah, I'd be worried about doing that. That's something that I don't condone whatsoever. Stop being cheap bastards and get a decent tool. Someone said to me about uh, the actual um, pin that you could get a replacement eBay, off eBay. Uh, I'll actually buy that to see if it actually is a replacement because I don't believe it is because um, as far as I know from did themselves, you can't get the pins. So I don't know where they're getting them. They're probably cheap shitty pins and that's the, the whole problem. The body, like I say, it's meh meh so so. It's the pin that's the bad boy. Any road, what is this competition? I'm going to give away two of these, not broken obviously with this broken box. I'm going to give two brand new of these bad boys away, the did ones. I'm going to give them away. So you might be thinking to yourself, Matt, I'd love that. How do I win this competition? <laughs> this is actually a mate of mine who came up with this idea and uh, at first I was like, eh, but then now I think about it, I thought, absolutely awesome. So, uh, just to wind up all Dell bollocks, the way you enter this competition is you go on to Dell's video, which is the swing arm video of his fighter build, which is number 100. There will be a link in this description, uh, link in the description of this video. Uh, basically, you go to Dell's channel and you type into the comments, I want, I want it, Dell. If you put, I want it, Dell, then you'll enter them in the competition. I will go down his comments. Now, some people say, oh, you're winding up Dell again, and that's just fucking horrible. You're purposely sending people up to his channel. Dell will be getting the views, right? If you have to, you to comment, you have to go to his video. Don't have to watch it, but that is counted as a view. So people can fuck off. If a 1,000 people go over to Dell's channel and put, Dell, I want this, then, you know, it's just to wind up the wanker. It's just a bit of fun. You know what I mean? So, don't explain anything. If he asks, don't explain anything. Just put Dell, I want this. And that's it. That's how you enter. I will then pick uh, two people uh, a month from now. So, I'll put the date up on the screen here where it will. No, 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 not there. Oh, fucking hell, there. I'll put the date there of when this is going to close, approximately a month from now. I'll pick two people at random from that list and then I will send you. Um, one of these did tools, brand new, in its nice box that isn't fucking completely destroyed. Hope that makes sense, and I'll see you in a bit.